Hi, my name is Carl Lennon, leader for architecture and design for the business unit projects for Lixil and Mina. And this is my wow of the week. We were so impressed by the quality of the candidates' work. It feels amazing achievement. It was just massive excitement inside. I want to bring happiness. I want to bring joy to people. I literally applied not because of the scholarship, but because I knew that there was something like this coming afterwards, so a round table and talking to designers. NEWH has been around now for nearly 40 years. It was set up in the US and the primary reason that it was set up was to raise scholarship money for students in, in college, effectively to support them in their ambitions to, to get into interior design. So the work that the NEWH does with the scholarship program really does support this and give them the best start and opportunity in their future career as a designer or an architect working in the projects industry. So NEWH is like a stepping stone to that and the more kind of awareness we can give them and more exposure to build up their contact list is, uh, is really the main reason I'm, I'm here and why I'm part of NEWH. So the, the fundraiser, which is our main year, is where we actually give the awards, the scholarship awards to the students that have been nominated. Grow is so proud to be part of the NEWH and delighted to have contributed to the scholarship programme. Hi, I'm Gina Rappaport, I'm from Sheffield Hall University and I'm one of the NEWH scholarship winners. Hi, I'm Hamiri Marzocchi from Middlesex University Interior Design Course and I'm one of the winners of the NEWH competition. Hello, my name is Bianca and I'm one of the three winners of the new competition. Essentially the brief that was set by the NEWH for the students was to look at a space, a lobby space, set in St Kitts and they had to create a unique lobby that was assigned to a hotel group or brand and really understand the locality of where they were delivering this. The scholarship, it's amazing because I can put towards my master's degree, which is another thing that I really, really want to achieve. So it opens lots and lots of doors for me. Money to be invested in my future, for material for university or going to other events like this to network and meet people from the industry. I will spend my uh, scholarship money on investing um, in a tablet because I really want to uh, develop uh, my skills. I really, really hope that after this, this day uh, we can stay in touch with people, you know, and build up our networking and someday maybe we can collaborate. I'm so proud because it was my very first competition uh, as an interior designer and I would like to say a massive thank you to this amazing opportunity. I think we all say it, but I think we've all forgotten actually just how important it is to connect face to face. It makes a real difference. So walking in today and seeing that room full, every round table with a major host and you know buzzing, it was just phenomenal. It really was amazing. Hello, Emily and Bianca. Huge congratulations on this excellent achievement. On behalf of the Interiors Directorate at Middlesex, very well done. Congratulations and celebration. We want the world to know that we're so proud of you. Love you, Emily. Hi, Gina. Just wanted to give you a massive congratulations from myself, Rachel, and from Austin. Well done. Amazingly well done. We're so proud of you. Have a fantastic evening, and I hope it all goes well. See you soon. Bye bye. As a person, I've grown really a lot, and I feel like that what I was thinking of doing in my project, it wasn't just something silly or somebody would not understand. The judges, they loved it. And it feels like, wow, I know what I'm doing. 